Oh, that we have been in YouTube for a few weeks. We have been very busy already. In history, we have been learning about a very special, famous person. We may have heard of her. Her name was Rose Nightingale. We started by coming up with some questions. Then we watched a DVD all about her. We've done some research to find more information about her. Why was she called Florence? She was named after a city in Italy where she was born. Does she have a special pet? Yes. Florence had a pet owl called Athena. Did she always want to be a nurse? Florence studied very hard when she was young and was determined to help others. How did she train to be a nurse? She had to teach herself by reading lots and lots of books. Where did she work as a nurse? To begin with, she started nursing in London. I thought she nurse for women for soldiers in the war. Yes, the Crimean War broke out in Scutari, in Turkey, to work in hospitals. Yes, darling, we started. Lots of people didn't know her and her nurse there. They thought that her mom was my favourite lady. She was determined and she took several nurses with her and trained them herself. The hospital was smelly, dirty and full of rats. Some of the wounded and sick slept on the floor. Oh, soldiers! What did Florence do? Florence sent her team of nurses to clean the hospital from some rooms and brought Clean linen for the beds. The army didn't want to clock. The army didn't want to cut out wounded soldiers and pay for their care, so Ford paid for the care herself. What is Florence holding? That's her lamp. The soldiers called her the Lady Matilda. They used to kiss her shadow as she as she walked past with it. Sounds made lamps like the one Florence would have had.
are enjoying our English lessons and we write ink spellings, so watch out parents will be testing you soon. This is the poem we have been learning about Florence Nightingale. Thank you for listening to our assembly. Make sure you come back for our next one in the spring term.